All right, uh, here we are with the uh, first uh, event of the women's UFC. Uh, let me tell you what, uh, I'm kind of new at this when it comes to UFC, and I'm not really gonna do any other plan. I'm just gonna pretty much just watch the action, I guess. But we're starting out with our first uh, match, Elite versus Carter in the Sprawweight uh, division. As, uh, and I didn't know what kind of intro or anything to do, what kind of music to do with this. Awesome. So, Coming off a like great I said, I'm doing this and feels <laughs> with, outstanding. Uh, with Ultimate Fighter. This girl has off the charts cardio. It is one of her biggest assets and one of the things that she pushes the hardest on. She knows that most fighters can't keep up with her, so she drags them into a race that they simply can't win. It's one of her strongest assets, and she is extremely confident in utilizing it. There's Miss Carter. Miss <laughs> Carter. 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 And here comes the very first uh, fighter that I uh, created. Mystery. Pumped up. Very confident. Leo and Lee. ready to battle in the octagon. From Tokyo, Japan. This girl has excellent footwork. It's one of her strongest qualities. She is very difficult to hit. And she can close the distance and hit you very quickly. Very tough to train with anybody who can emulate the type of footwork so, that when she I first, possesses. Uh, when I first made this one, uh, to be honest, I had to, I had to go back and redo it because I made this one overpowered. Because <laughs> I gave her every skill and everything that you could have, every ability, and uh, I had to go back and uh, change that. I need to have more wrestlers. Most of them are boxers. I need to get more wrestlers. I'm... All right, here we go. <laughs> Dan, the ref. <laughs> So, I'm going to tell you what, I do not know the rules, I don't know how they score, I only go by, I guess we call old boxing rules, if it looks like a good hit, <laughs> it looks like a good hit. The wrestling rules really confusing. Ooh, nice kick to the face. That body shot was blocked. Tying up in the clinch here. Oh, I didn't know you could stump on toes. <laughs> and from here transitions to the Muay Thai mm -hmm. clinch. Oh, that's a takedown. Now in wrestling, that would be a that would be a takedown and a near fall. Now, see what she just did? Going to her back? We would never teach that in actual wrestling. We never teach you to go to your back. See? The first thing that we tell you to do once you fall to your back is try to roll to your stomach. Looking for the arm bar, looking for the finish. See? Here, being up on top, you're a judge in wrestling, you be trying to, how you say, get the pin by the bottom that you be trying to get out of that position and work your way back to your feet or to a position where you can uh, reverse on them. 
Let's see right here. We'll tell you to throw the half on the top. Throw a half and turn her. But she's already on her back. So. Ooh. Ooh, that was. Ooh, slap another ball. I didn't know you could slap the head like this. Oh, my goodness. Ooh, it's killing her. Miss, Miss Kata, Miss Kata, calm down. Ooh, ooh. She getting some punches in now. And this is just plain, I just don't like you. <laughs> ooh, that was a forearm right there. Ooh. Oh, and they called it. Wow! I will call that a knockout. <laughs> and that's a bonus of five points because she did it in the first round. So not only does she get the points for the win, she gets five extra points. So that's seven points for Miss Kata. What a way to start your season. TKO. <laughs> I'm out of investing that song. <laughs> that was a butt whooping. So she gets to celebrate getting the first victory of the the WUFC. That's what I'm calling it. <laughs> Alright, so the next match we got Adams and Lopez. See who got the next uh, battle. I like Miss Lopez's uh, theme song. Lights out, looking very confident as she makes her way to the octagon. She's ready to go. This girl has ridiculous stamina. The ability to push a pace that her opponent can't keep up with is one of her strongest assets. Her cardio is off. The Luna Lopez. I like that music, man. Back in the now keep in all keep in mind all of these uh fighters are rookies, so Come uh, Marla Allen from Colorado. Feels very sharp with her skills and is really looking to impress tonight and earn a big UFC victory. This girl has amazing cardio and stamina. It is one of her best assets. She keeps a very fast pace, and you can literally see opponents start to wilt in the second and third round when they're being forced to try to keep up with her. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, let's go, let's go. Let's get. Uh oh, oh. Here we go, round two. Uh, excuse me, match number two. Monster is 19. Lights out is one inch tall. She will have a one inch reach advantage. Once again, here's the better voice of the Amazon. Bruce Buffer. But take over, Bruce. She might be my tallest uh, fighter in in this thing so far. I don't know. I have to see about uh, Betty. Betty might be the tallest. Come out kicking to the head. Big kick, but miss. 
So far, I call it even. Oh, not no more. <laughs> Lopez with a nine. Oh, nope. She's down. She's down. She got a nice kick to the head, but then she went down to the mat. Ooh. 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 Mm. Oh, oh, Lopez be kicking. <laughs> Just missed with the straight left. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Failed attempt. Nope. Miss. Nope. Fainting. Uh oh, okay. Locking up. Locking up. Locking up. Don't locked up. Great job blocking the knee. Mm -mm, mm -mm, don't oh and Miss Lopez is down. Oh hit to the head. And Miss Adams is on top. And as we saw in the last match, this could be bad. Ooh, a little elbow. Elbows, forms, smacking them in the back of the head. Mm -mm. Okay. Now that's a wrestling move. Turn it to your stomach. But keep in keep in mind though in wrestling the top guy can't choke you <laughs> ooh, 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 got some blood got some blood oh and we got another TKO another first round TKO and that's a five bonus points in the first round for uh, Miss Adams with the official decision. Wow. Okay. Victorious by TKO. Now you see why we call him monster. <laughs> oh, by the way, we call this event the MGM uh, Classic Challenge or something like that. Classic. Yeah, MGM Classic. Alright, now the third and final uh, bout of this uh, event. We got Brown taking on Lee, the lie, or Lou, Lou, lie, Lee. So, so far, we don't have some first round Ready to go defeats. To <laughs> <laughs> this girl has outstanding wrestling. That is her specialty, and that is what she's going to look to do. Oh, yeah, I did make a wrestler. Take her opponent down and utilize some ground and pound. She also has very good takedown defense because of that wrestling. So, if she's getting the better of the stand up, she might decide to keep it on the feet. <laughs> Okay. Okay, okay. Uh oh, she doing the shuffle, doing the shuffle. That's that was alright. Try doing that for a hundred yards down the field. <laughs> How we used to do at a quicker pace. <laughs> then they add the twist. They call it the karaoke. Man, I used to hate those. <laughs> All right, here comes Betty Brown. It is one of her biggest assets. <laughs> the girl with the green hair. The hardest on. She knows that most fighters can't keep up with her, so she drags him into a race that they simply can't win. It's one of her strongest. Ooh, I think she is the biggest one. She is extremely confident in utilizing. What was that? Was the wings that came out the back. Oh, I'm scared. Run, run. <laughs> Our tail of the tape for this strong weight fight. Both fighters are 20. Uh, actually, she's 5'3", so she's not overly taller than anyone else. She just looks taller. Looks bigger. Thank you for 
professional debut here tonight. She stands five feet one inch tall, weighing in at 101 pounds. On the other side, going out to Japan, Lee. All right, all right. And now we come to your home. Fighting out of the red corner. This woman is a wrestler. Take your professional debut here in Orlando, Florida. She got to be the heaviest, though. <laughs> oh, come on, man. Mario Yamasaki, our referee. Mike Goldberg, Joe Rogan. All right, let's see what we got. Let's see what we got. Okay. We came out with a couple of... Ooh, nice knee. Looks like Brown is not connecting cl cleanly. Mm -hmm. Nice punch by Brown. Once again, ooh, ooh. Great job defending that double. She tried to go uh for the takedown, but she was able to uh, Lee was able to push her off. Mm, that's a nice block on the oh, knee. Very nice. Came up with the uppercut. Oh. Oh, overhand. <laughs> she missed that one completely. Both fighters are mm -hmm. here. Ooh. All right, they're locked up now. From the clinch. Nice hook to the body in the yeah. clinch by Brown. Getting some. Uh oh, oh. Wow, Me. Muay Thai plus Me. Clinch. Me. Mm -mm. They battle in the clinch, looking for a dominant position. Can't seem to. Uh, and right okay. to the Me. Muay Thai clinch. Me. So they trade knees. Three <laughs> in the round. And separate. Oh, oh, the uh oh. Single leg. <laughs> now, see, that is a classic wrestling move right there. We call that the single leg takedown. So, I get, it looks like she kind of go with some type of uh, submission. She popped out of submission. Great work from the bottom. Like you said, in actual wrestling, we would never teach the bottom person to be on their back because that's the losing position. As soon as those two shoulders to hit the mat, Big punch from the bottom. parallel with each other, that is, oh, now see, that's what we call a classic reversal. Side control. So you got, so you got ooh, <laughs> hadn't seen the bottom person punch like that. Mm -mm, block. Ooh, nope. 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 Oh. Ooh. She got one in. Mm -mm. What's that hair grabbing? One minute remains in round one. Uh, Miss Brown is, is taking the worst for a wear Washers here. Up. Great left by Brown. She's still trying to fight, though. Good ground and pound. She's looking uh -oh. to set up an arm bar. Trying to do a submission. Oh, right here. 20 seconds. She's got that arm mm -mm. bar locked up. Can she get it? Can she get it? No. Oh. oh. Got the arm bar. Solid left by him. Got a re re reversal there. Round one comes to an end. And whoa. We finally got one that goes past the first round. That was some good fighting. <clears throat> and here we see some beautiful submission offense here. And there's another excellent attempt at the submission but can't quite finish it. And let's take a look at that from a different camera. And maybe not. <laughs> Ooh, worse for wear. So, uh, hey, we in uh, some unfamiliar territory as we moving into the second round. <laughs> we hadn't done that yet. Whoa! The lovely Brittany getting a set for round number two. Okay, okay, okay. Hey... Sorry about that. <laughs> All right, let's go round two. round two. Brown and Lee. Nice leg kick there, Joe. Oh, nice kick to the head by Brown. Ooh, right to the face. Lee, Lee getting some nice punches in. Oh, oh. Brown had to back up. Oh, kick to the head. Oh, kick to the stomach. They must have said something to it in uh, doing the break. <laughs> 
Uh oh, takedown. going for the takedown. Nope, she blocked it. Nah, you ain't gonna toss her like that. That ain't happening. <laughs> Locks up the plum. Lee with some knees to the body. Mm -mm. Joe, here we see our total strikes landed. And they're hitting them knees now. Nice knee. Uh-uh, no knee. Mm -mm. She's doing a mm -mm. great job utilizing double underhooks. Shoulder strikes. She's in a nice position now with the tie. Oh, push. and she gets the uh, takedown. Oh, oh, punch to the head. In the half guard. Wow, look at that. How good is that? Uh oh. Mm -mm. Nope. Nice left left hand. Oh, oh man. Whew. Them punches while they on the ground. So she's going for another submission. Nope. Almost had the arm bar. Got the reverse. Uh oh, there she go. Try to take the back here. Mm -mm. Oh, nice punch. Uh oh, back there with some bottom punches. Joe, she's showcasing some great movement on the ground. She's a wrestler. She's supposed to. She's moved back to full guard now. Mm -mm. Almost got the mug in the headlock. Reverse the headlock, that is. Tries to pass here, but gets shut down. Snuck in a punch right there, Lee. Nope. Couldn't get a punch there. Right in the guard again, Joe. Okay. Nice. Uh oh, now Betty going for the reverse, and she got it. Uh-oh. Now, the one thing about uh, Lee, she don't stay at the bottom. She will reverse it on you. Tries to pass, but cannot. Okay. Got the clinch. Okay. Battle for control here. Final seconds of round two. They have fought for ten minutes. That's the end of round two. Oh, so we're going the distance, ladies and gentlemen. We are going the distance. Oh, look at that. Look at the face, boy. The lovely Ariane. Ariane. In Las Vegas, Nevada. All right, here we go. Round three. Ooh, ooh. And Lee coming over with the uppercut. Oh, oh. Strong hook to the body. Again, heavy leg mm. kick. Mm. Mm. Changing things up. Oh, she one stepped into that one. Beautiful knee. Knee, them knees. Nice Man, you can see oh, the what happened there? Her left eye starting to close up. Betty just fell. <laughs> that left misses. Mm. Oh, oh and Lee just fell. Uh oh. And Betty trying to take advantage of it. Nice combination of strikes from the full guard. Lee with good work from the body. <laughs> mm -mm. She's trying to reverse it. No, she she does that well. Now where Betty is, well, where she was on the ground, we would teach a swim move. To keep the uh, lot of work in the wrestler in from getting behind you. She's gotten herself to the tie clinch. It's a it's a technique when 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 you when you like head to head like that and you're not the top person, but they don't have control because they got to get behind you. And you just and when they try to go left or right, you just use a swim move to hook them and keep them from getting like right here. <laughs> You use a swim move to keep him from getting behind you like that. But I don't think they teach that. <laughs> uh, we got some blood on the mat. See, that would be a pin right there. And the match would be over in wrestling. Nice left.
Now, see, Ben need to learn to do a swim move to keep Lee from getting behind her, but she didn't need to because, like I said, in this game, they teach them to go to their back. Oh, nice punch from the bottom. Oh, man. <laughs> Betty with some punches. <laughs> in fact, she the only one that, that punches from the bottom. We didn't see much of that from the other two in the last match. Matches, bouts. But we seen a lot of this reversals right there. Now, in the position that they was in, it would have been Lee that need to make the swear moves. But, like I said, it's a totally different wrestling. And hey, we went the distance. And here's Bruce Buffer. And Lee gets the decision. Wins here tonight. And she gets two points for the victory. And that's basically it. No bonus points. So that immediately puts her in third place. Behind Adams and Carter. So, uh, shoot, I got to do a... So, right here, we're looking at the, I guess you would call the, the, uh, tail of the tape, or the card sheet, or the stats. <laughs> As we're looking at, uh, Lee versus Carter. And we're looking at Adam versus Lopez. You can take those stats for whatever you want to, cause I don't, I don't know what to do with those. Like I said, this one went the distance. So hey, that was entertaining. Thank you for watching. I'm going to flash the uh, standings as we uh, uh, shoot up out of here. But hey, we appreciate you. And hope you enjoyed uh, the WUFC. And we'll see you in the next event. Till then, you have a good one.